Hello, my crafty friends. Welcome back to Cards TV. I'm so glad you could stop by today. This is Mary. I've got a couple of series going on right now. We've got the 12 Days of Christmas cards, and we're, we've done card number 8, so card number 9 will be coming up soon. I've also got a series of four little friendship cards that I'm making up into a set to have on hand for an extra Christmas gift in case I need one and we'll be getting back to that one so just to make it a little bit more interesting we're starting another series today and this is going to be tags for our Christmas gifts today we're going to use joys of the season and art philosophy now for the first tag in this series we'll be using the art philosophy cartridge and we'll cut the tag on page 50 and this is called tag number three I cut it at four inches and then I came up here to layer and cut this little frame also at four inches out of white and the tag is this cute little red and white gingham and I'm going to take my two-way glue pen and adhere these together now if you don't have art philosophy you can find that same shape tag on several other cartridges but we'll just get this put together these tags are really quick but I think they're going to be cute now we've got this adhered on the front now from the joys of the season cartridge I wanted to cut this cute little Santa face it's a profile of Santa and this is on page 46 and instead of cutting this one right here that has the eye cut out and all the lines where you would add your different layers I just cut it out on the blackout because I just wanted to add a little black dot for his eye and I wanted to give him some rosy cheeks so I took some uh, very light coral cardstock and cut this out so it looks like skin tone and then I came up here to layers and cut his beard his hat and the little pom-pom for his hat and I cut him at two inches and here he is I think he turned out super cute now I did go ahead and adhere that uh, little cardstock pom-pom to the end of his Santa hat but then I took an actual little white pom-pom and uh, added that on there because I like the extra dimension and as you can see I did take my little uh, zig black pen and just used the dot for his eye and I took a q-tip and some pink chalk just to give him a rosy cheek because Santa's always out in the cold and he's got rosy cheeks now I've got him on two thicknesses of foam tape and I'm gonna center him right here on my tag and that is looking pretty cute already but you know me I thought it would be even cuter if we added a few little buttons so I went to Joann's and I got a little package of the Christmas colored buttons and these are two shades of red and two shades of green is what they come in they're from favorite findings and I'm using the darker one on here and I'm just gonna take my glue dots and add a little button in between these scallops and I really like the way that looks so let's go ahead and get these put on I've got my buttons all on and I took the backing off the foam tape and now Santa's adhered to the front and you can see that dimension there I really really like that now I took the home for Christmas stamp set I was going to use ho 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 but it was a little bit too big I thought for this tag so I decided to use believe and I've put that on a little banner I stamped it with memento tuxedo black ink and I went around it very lightly with some Tim Holtz tea dye distress ink and I'm gonna add that right up here and let it hang off this side just a little bit and then we're gonna run some Baker's twine through here and get the back stamped and we'll have a tag done see how quick and easy this is this is so much fun and it's gonna make the gifts that you give just really really special 
and it doesn't take that much time and you can make these out of scraps guys okay there's believe now this baker's twine is from the twinery and it's called maraschino i like it because it's rich dark red and i've cut two pieces and i think these are about yeah 12 inches each now i'm going to be folding it in half and i can never remember if i go through the front to the back or the back to the front so let's go in front to the back i think that's right if not i'll redo it and then put this through and this is going to seem a little long but i'm going to be yeah that's right front to the back i'm going to be uh, taking this end and tying it around the bow on my package so i can trim off the extra after i get that done but i think that turned out really cute i really like it now i'm going to take the christmas joy set and it has to and from and i'll stamp that on the back and i think i need to use home for christmas and stamp merry christmas on here as well so let me get my ink pad and we'll get that done and we'll have this first tag done well i just had so much fun doing this first one i went ahead and did another one out of green and white polka dot and i've stamped the back of both of them merry christmas to and from and I just love these. They're very simple, quick to make. You can make them out of scraps. And they're really going to look great on my packages when I get them wrapped. Thanks so much for watching today, guys. And I will see you again really soon. Bye now.